Today, we will be constructing a dry stack rock wall. The first step is to excavate a level base for the bottom course of stone. We begin laying the base course with large stable stones. Our mason shapes the stones with a rock hammer so that the faces of the stones are slightly convex and odd shapes are chipped away. Additional courses are laid with stones overlapping to give the wall more strength. If the seams of more than two courses of stone are laid above one another, the wall could buckle and fail. Rubble, waste stone, and clay soil are used to backfill the wall. The backfill is compacted so there are no air pockets. In constructing a low wall, we do not need additional drainage behind the wall. Larger stones are selected for the top cap of the wall to provide stability for sitting or occasionally stepping on the wall. No mortar is used in the construction. The wall will shift with the surrounding soil and freezes and thaws of winter, and a wall could last a hundred years or longer.